There is an easier way to go back and forth between metric conversions instead of having to memorize all these conversions by each one. So there is a helpful mnemonic to remember the order of the metric prefixes, which is especially useful when converting between units. The phrase that we always like to go by is, King Henry died drinking chocolate milk. Each word represents a prefix in the metric system. And I'll show you how to convert back and forth between all these. Okay, so how do we put King Henry, the mnemonic, to use? To convert back and forth between grams, liters, and meters. So King Henry really stands for K stands for kilo, H stands for hecto, D stands for deca, the second D in drinking stands for deci, and the C stands for centi, and last but not least, M stands for milli. In the middle of all these is our underlying base, which is where we put our grams, liters, and meters. Now remember, this doesn't work for all conversions. It only works for the three of these. So looking at our units of measure, our largest unit is our kilo. So whether that's kilogram, kilometer, kiloliter, smallest unit is at the bottom, milli, and again, milliliter, milligram. Each step in the metric system is based on a factor of 10. So moving down the chart from the larger unit like kilo to a smaller unit like milli, you multiply by 10 for each individual step. Now on the flip side, if you're moving up the chart from smaller units to larger units, you divide by 10 for each step. 